We are gathered here together in the Royal Foresters in Ascot. <laughs> and I'm, I'm really pleased to say that Martin Simpson's here, which is always a joy. Martin, thanks so much for coming. It's a total pleasure. I'm so pleased to be here. Congratulations. On uh, well, on the feet. On the feet. <laughs> 14 miles today. And Debbie Norris from Ballet Focus here is a special guest appearance that, that you brought a dancer uh, to join us. Who, who is the dancer? Yeah, so we've brought Anna Smith, who has been dancing with us recently in various festivals and our performances, and we're really delighted to be able to share a little pop-up improvisation this evening with one of Martin's tracks. It's really great to be here. But just tell us a little bit about Ballet Folk. Is it a, a company that goes around folk festivals and that kind of thing? Yeah, basically. started with Lucy Ward back in 2019. We made the Sisters of Elva Hill at Cambridge Folk Festival, and past two years we've been working with the side House Rebellion, who I know you've met on one of your walks, um, with the tears of Jenny Greenteeth, and we're finishing at Folk East, which I know you're finishing your walk there. I'm so see you um, there, am I? we will be there on the Saturday. I yes. won't look quite as fresh as I do now. I don't suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Martin, can I just ask why you wanted to come to support me in in this walk? It's just fantastic. Well, to have because you. you supported us so beautifully, you know, during lockdown. A lot of people, a lot of people would like to express their appreciation for what you do and so you know I got in the car and drove down from Sheffield and listened to a load of mixes and I felt like I was working on the way down here and now I don't feel like I'm working I feel like I'm doing something right so oh Martin that's fantastic well I'm going to let you get on with it uh, okay. let me get into position and then it's over to you right
sky plane caught fire over Lost Gatos Canyon. A fireball of lightning that shook all our hills. Who are all these friends all scattered like dry leaves? The radio says they are just deportees. Goodbye to my heart. Goodbye, Rosalita. Adios, mis amigos. Jesus, Maria. You won't have your names when you ride the big airplane. All they will call you will be deportees. Is this the best way we can grow our big orchards? Is this the best way we can grow our good fruit? To fall like dry leaves and rot on your topsoil And be known by no name except deportees Goodbye to my heart, goodbye Rosalita Adios mis amigos, Jesus y Maria You won't have your names when you ride the big airplane All day Goodbye to my heart, goodbye Rosalita, adios mis amigos, Jesus y Maria, you won't have your names when you ride the big airplane, all they will call you will be deportees, all they So that song was written by Woody Guthrie, of course. And I, uh, I sing it because I think it's very pertinent uh, in these days, you know, with a, a government that likes to dehumanize people. And I was trying to write a song about that. But that's the great thing about doing what I do. Sometimes you might not be able to write the song, but you look around and you find that the song's already been written. So that was a nice, a nice thing. This song I was asked to write. I was asked to write it by Chris Packham. And when Chris Packham <laughs> asks you to write a song, you know, you might think about it for 0.2 of a second or something like that. So this is a song about, um, about hen harriers. And hen harriers live on the moors up near me, but they don't live in as many numbers as they should on the moors near me, or indeed anywhere where there are grouse moors, because despite the fact that they're a red-listed endangered species, the people who own grouse moors uh, employ gamekeepers to shoot them and poison them and trap them, and it's, uh, it's an obscenity, really. And I'm really delighted to say that I have somebody to dance while I play this song. Um, I actually have had quite a lot of my music used by, uh, by Christopher Bruce and Mark Bruce from Ballet Rombe, which is in incredibly flattering. So I am immensely delighted to be playing this song and have, and have you dancing. Thank you so much. So this is Sky Dancers. Constellations shine among the blooming heatherling and the jade green berry bushes. The oak eggers are on the way. The 
storm chats and the pipits fly And spring lap wings and curlews cry But there is something missing, there are no dancers in the sky And the bird completes the skyline That is clear to see An empty sky's a heart break So what is it to be? The pale ash grey sky dancer Or this cruel tyranny At fifteen I saw the falcon fly At Simmons Yacht on the river Why? Scarce and unexpected then Red treasure in the sky In mid Wales fifty years ago The red kite's beauty lit the snow Now I might see them every day The falcon on the city cliffs Red kite by the motorway And the bird completes the skyline that is clear to see An empty sky's a heartbreak So what is it to be? The early ass dancer Or this shooting gallery The heathland it is burning Up above the valley town The greedy flame consumes the peace so when the rain comes down It pours across the moorland's wreck And overwhelms the stream and beckon Bursts the banks of stream and beckon Floods the town again And the bird completes the skyline That is clear to see An empty sky's a heartbreak So what is it to be? This life-supporting landscape Or this brutal tyranny That is clear to see An empty sky's a heartbreak So what is it to be? The pale ash grey sky dancer Or this wasteful cruelty? Martin's playing. What a beautiful sight that was, wasn't it, Martin? Fabulous. Actually, it did make me forget a couple of lines. I was like... <laughs> but we We're distracted. I think we got away with it. <laughs> beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank you, Anna. So I promised you I'd, I'd sing you a new song. Uh, this is... Uh, song about a real human being, a man called Billy Waters, and uh, Billy Waters was a black American sailor um, in the, the years, at the latter end of the Napoleonic Wars, and uh, for some reason, I'm not quite sure why, he joined the British Navy in 1811 which was the year before the kickoff of the War of 1812, which was the British versus the Americans. He was an able seaman at that point, but he joined the British Navy. We've got time for this, right? Of course. <laughs> we have all the time in the world, Martin. The first, the first ship he sailed with was a transport ship, and the captain on the ship was Jane Austen's brother, which I think is, you know, you can't get all the information into the song, so I thought I'd add that in, in the introduction. <laughs> 
he then transferred to a frigate and called the Ganymede and he became a quarter gunner and a petty officer on the Ganymede which meant that he was an incredibly good sailor let's just remind ourselves he was a black American in the British Navy so we're looking at we're looking at a man really going up the ranks you know and then he was shortening sail and he fell from the yards and he fell from the topmost yard to the deck and was smashed to bits basically they took his left leg off at the knee sent him out in London that was it his navy work was done but he was a fiddle player and uh, and so he went down to the place where he lived which was it was called the Holy Land because it was so full of Irish immigrants that's interesting fact I didn't know that so the Holy Land was adjacent to a massive slum called the Rookery and that's where he lived and he married an English woman called Polly I think called Polly might have been called Kitty but we think Polly they had two kids and he became famous so you can find pictures of this man and he danced and he played the fiddle and he busked on the strand and uh, he was he became so famous that he was written into a contemporary musical and which sort of it it reported on the street life of the time but in that musical they made him out to be a lowlife and a cheat which was he was not he was an honorable human being um, the result of the way he was depicted ended up in him being basically arrested and told that he could not play anymore on the street in fact if he d did play anymore uh, he would be imprisoned but not only that in order to survive because he couldn't survive without playing music he would have to leave his wife and live basically at the discretion of the the navy's charity so he chose not to do that and he died and uh, I think it's an, an astonishing story and I could not not write a song about it so I thought right, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get in touch with Angeline Morrison and say Angeline why don't we co-write this song and she said well I'd love to but I'm already writing a song about Billy Waters so I said well tough <laughs> because I'm writing mine now so this is Billy Waters and it starts it kind of sets the scene um, because what, I, what I'm just looking at this because I'd, I'd love to be able to get the words right there's a lot of words in this song um, I've set the scene by starting with a, a sea shanty called Lowlands and then the song itself has various different parts and part of it is like a shanty but it's a shanty borrowed from from old-timey American music and then there's a little fiddle tune kind of thing in there as well so this is Billy Waters bless his heart we should all know about him I think the one
to sail the sea, sail on Billy, sail away. A bold and brave black man was he, sail on Billy, sail away. Billy come from New York town, sail on Billy, sail away, and he sailed the ocean all around. Sail on Billy, sail away. Billy waters sailed the sea, sail on Billy, sail away, and an able seaman soon was he. Sail on Billy, sail away, and Billy could fiddle and dance and sing. Sail on Billy, sail away, and he joined the navy of the king. Sail on Billy. Billy joined the navy of the king for honor and promotion. Gunner on the Ganymede, petty officer on the ocean. But fate struck Billy a cruel blow. Sail on Billy, sail away, fell from the yards to the deck below. Sail on Billy, sail away. And he broke both legs and more beside. Sail on Billy, sail away. They took him to the surgeon on the tide. Sail on Billy, sail away. And they took his left leg at the knee. Sail on Billy, sail away, no further use to the king's navy. Able seaman on the sea, disabled pauper on the shore, but Billy could fiddle and dance and sing and make his way among the poor. Billy wore his hat like a full-rigged ship that sailed upon his judge's wing. And he played the fiddle on the strand and danced an elegant peg leg jig. Billy's coat was faded blue, he wore his heart upon his sleeve. For Polly was his own dear love, and Billy's love was proud and true. And he sings, Polly, won't you marry me? Polly, won't you cry? Polly, come to bed with me, we'll make a little boy he sings. Polly, won't you marry me? Polly, don't you cry. Polly, come to bed with me, we'll make a little boy. Billy was soon famous, playing down upon the strand. There were those who'd paint his picture, there were those who'd shake his hand. But some thought Billy a vagabond and a saucy blackamoor. Immoral and a beggar was the verdict of the law. I must pawn my fiddle, Polly, they won't let me play no more. I must lay down in the workhouse cot. My heart is very sore. Billy Waters sailed the sea, sail on Billy, sail away, and a bold and brave black man was he. Sail on Billy, sail away. Billy Waters sailed the sea, sail on Billy, sail away, and a bold and brave black man was he, sail on Billy, sail away.
so amazing, Martin. What a privilege to hear that song for the first time. It's a, a, an amazing song and incredibly moving. I hope so. Yeah, definitely. I, re I really want, I really wanted to write a song which honoured that man because, you know, we. I've talked to so many people, really well-educated people, and said, so do you know about Billy Waters? Never heard of him. And he's a major figure, you know. I mean, the, the Museum of London sells prints of him. Right. But it's wonderful that you brought him to our attention. It's so wonderful that you've come here today, all the way from Sheffield, to support us, Martin. Thank Total you. It's pleasure. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, Martin Simpson.